Hi everyone, welcome to Design School MC. In this video, I will create crown logo design or crown icon design. Okay, first I will um, select ellipse tool and I will create object like this. Okay, and I will duplicate this object. Go to edit, select copy, edit, pitch in front. I will create this crown using a simple technique. I will cut this object, go to part render and click manage front. Okay, and I will create star object using star tool and change the point to 5. The radius one is 25 and radius 2 is 50. Click OK. And change the color using white color. Scroll over here and click OK. Put this star over here and change the size to small put over here change the rotation like this okay like that and select the pencil over here click here 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 and here I will change the color using brown color like this object double click on the fill Right click over here, copy this color code, and select this object. Go to uh, double click on the fill, right click over here, and select page. Click OK, and create circle object using ellipse tool like that. And once again, but very small, maybe like that. I will put this circle over here, maybe a little bit bigger. And I will copy this color code, right click, copy, select the small circle, double click on the fill, right click on this dialog box, click pets, click OK. I think that looks good and I will uh, select the pencil over here and create object like this. Select direct selection tool to edit this point. Select this point and scroll over here. Zoom in. Click this point and put over here. And this point two over here. Um, maybe over here. Okay, over here. And I will um create another object. Select the pen tool. Uh, I will using brown color select the pen tool click here here maybe click here 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 and here once again okay maybe over here too And once again over here, but a little bit small. Create object a little bit small like that. And maybe I need to edit this uh, object to make look like a little bit bigger. Maybe like that. I will um, group the circle. Right click, select group. And I will duplicate the circle. Pitch in front. Put over here. Change the size a little bit bigger like that I will copy the circle object and put over here change the size a little bit bigger maybe once again put over here change the size a little bit small change the rotation like this In the circle 2, change the rotation like this. In the circle 2, maybe like this. Okay, I will duplicate the circle object. Go to edit, select copy, edit, pitch in front, and I will put the circle over here and change the size a little bit small. Maybe like that. I will change the rotation like this. A little bit on the right. 
Okay, um, maybe I will edit this object. Select the direct selection tool, click this point, scroll a little bit on the right, and in this point too, a little bit on the right, and select this circle, put over here. Okay, like that. And I will um, change the size of the star object, a little bit small, put over here. I will delete this object over here. Okay, I will duplicate the star object and I will put over here, change the size a little bit bigger. Maybe I, I need to zoom in. Okay, like that, I will duplicate this star object, put it over here, change the size a little bit bigger, and change the rotation like this. In this star object too, change the rotation like this. I will duplicate this star, put it over here, change the size a little bit small. Okay, once again, I will duplicate the star and put over here. Okay, I think that looks good. Um, I will create, uh, I will make this line looks good. Select the pencil over here, zoom in, click here, here and scroll like that. Click this point. And click here, scroll like that. And click here, you can follow me. I need to change the color using brown color like this. I will copy this color code and select this object, change the color using brown color over here. Click OK. I will use uh, make this space look like like this to make this crown looks good. Click here, scroll going up. I will change the color like this once again. Click here. Click here, scroll like that. Click this point. Click here, scroll like that. Click here, 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 and close this point. Once again. Click here. Click here, scroll like that. Click this point. Click here and scroll like that. Click here, 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 and close this point. Okay, zoom out. I think that looks much better. And now I need to adjust this star. I mean the position of this star object. Over here. And this over here. Here and here. Maybe I need to delete this star. And this star object too. And I will duplicate the star. I put over here. Go to edit, select copy, edit, pitch in front. Put over here. Change the size a little bit small. Maybe a little bit bigger like that. And duplicate the star. Um, select the star. Go to edit, select copy, edit, pitch in front. Put over here and change the rotation. Click here and uh, change like that. The size a little bit small. Okay, I think that looks good. I will change this rotation a little bit here. 
Okay, that looks good. Uh, maybe I need to create uh, something in this part to make this crow and it looks much better. Click here, scroll like that. Click this point. Click here, scroll like that. Click this point and scroll like that. Okay, and I will change the color using crow and color. Uh, I mean brown color. Right click. Um, I need to copy this color code. Double click on the wheel. Right click on this dialog box, click copy. Select this object, double click on the fill, right click on this dialog box, click paste, click OK. Alright, I think that lo looks much better. And I will group this crown. Right click, select group, and put on the center of here. And I will change the size a little bit bigger. Zoom in and zoom out. I will put on the center of my background maybe like this okay like that zoom out okay I think that looks good okay guys I hope you learned something in this video and if you have a question you can leave a comment below and if you are happy with my video tutorial don't forget to click like share and subscribe my youtube channel to get new video tutorial every I update new video and you can go to my youtube channel in design school mc and you can watch more video tutorial and see you on the next video